What up, what up, guys? Uncomplacent Living, your boy Big G. Today I got a special video for you today. I'm gonna show you how to go out, get a horse, catch your own cow, butcher it, get your steak off of it, grill your steak, and enjoy it at the end of the day. This is Dominican Republic, guys, so sometimes we just go out and catch our own meat. We fry it up, and it's fresh. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys today. I'm gonna take you along. Follow me. Let's do this. It's your boy. So first off, guys, I had to go out and get some lasso lessons. Now, this I'll tell you what, this is not an easy thing to do, but, you know, with enough practice, we can all become proficient at anything. And after that, I got to practice on a few uh, of the cattle that they had around. Um, these aren't for eating. These are just kind of practicing my skills. So, um, yeah, and some of them are a little bit agile. So I had to, you know, move around real quick and learn this. But after a while, I kind of got the hang of it. Yeah, guys, so once you lasso one, you kind of got to jump off the horse and grab that thing real fast and, you know, tie him up. And then you got him. In the end, this is the actual one that I went ahead and caught. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and butcher him up, you know, and head to the next step, guys. I borrowed a guy's tractor and um, it helped out a lot because this thing was heavy and we got her done. I got my wife to help me butcher it all up, which was a lot of meat. Um, I don't know why she was looking like that, but then I remembered in the past, she looked a way like that actually here. And I think she was just frightened a little bit, but you know, we got her done and we handled it. So as you can see guys, this was a long day. Uh, after we got done at the butcher shop, went ahead and headed home, um, got the meat ready. I'm going to go ahead and fire up the grill, you know, and I'm um, going to go from there. And hopefully this steak tastes pretty good. But as you can see, it's not easy doing going through all this, but it's an accomplishment. Yeah, guys, so before you cook your steak, you know, you want to let it uh, be room temperature, which ours already was because it was fresh. We just you know handle that and you want to go ahead and choose some seasonings that you would enjoy these are some that i have uh, as you can see the original seasoning is out because we used it all um some good stuff yeah so i'll put the grill on high let it heat up that the rack and then i went ahead and start cleaning off the old stuff that we already cooked on here um Cause you know you kind of want a fresh grill uh clean up that old stuff and let the other uh meat get ready to get on here then you're good to go all right now the grill is clean meat is ready let's go ahead and put it on there and let's hear it sizzle once you get it on there you can smell that aroma right off the bat there you go After a few minutes, guys, you want to go ahead and flip that meat. 
Um, it's all up to you how long you want to cook it for, your preference. Um, just take it from there. Alright guys, now it's done. It's time to enjoy. My wife made some fresh tortilla, tortilla chips. Um, we're gonna just dip that in some salsa. We're gonna eat this steak. We're just gonna enjoy life. And look out at this beautiful view. This is paradise. Yeah, guys, so I didn't have to take the horse back till tomorrow, so I figured why not take a nice romantic stroll on the beach, just me and my wife, and just live our lives. All right, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Every single day, I'm gonna make something great.